Hey, orange one here. So uh, we're going to be starting off right where we left off with some of the gardening. So from what you remember, we had a couple things planted here that we were trying to get uh, planted a little bit more in bulk. Um, unfortunately, though, it seems like when I try and do this here, it, it has some issues. It's not too happy with the idea that it has to uh, plant things. Um, see, did I do... I did not do H for my, for the hoe. Where is it? The tools. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, I also want, oh, I'm, I'm wielding the hoe, of course. Um, so yeah, let's, let's till the soil. And unfortunately, we will be able to um, kind of like farm these plots, but it we need to get them like tilled first. So I'm going to spend a little bit of time doing that. And I'll talk while we're doing that is basically the plan. Oh, also, I wanted to show you guys this. Um, I made a charcoal, um, which we call like a survival marker right here. I used that to write on some little scraps of a paper wrapper here, just to give myself some notes to carry around. Because I always am like, you know, I saw once Critzy Bear pulled up like a notebook document, but I figured why not do that in game, right? So I give myself a couple things like, okay, so I need to set up the farm, get water for the car base missions and hunting for food oh and also solar panels for the car and improving them so now i know pretty much everything that i need and this thing takes up um 0 0.005 liters of volume so perfect right he just wrote really small with this charcoal on there um, <laughs> yeah it's it's bizarro but i love it um i'm sure that there's a faster way of doing this but honestly I don't mind it. Yeah, I just think that it'd be really nice if we got this fo um, food up and growing as soon as possible. Um, I could probably do some of this off camera, but I wanted to just kind of do a little bit on camera because it is something that I want to make sure that we have set up properly. Um, I know that you can also put on tractors onto cars, but we would have to A, get the parts or build the parts and then attach it onto our car, which is totally fine. We could totally do that. Um, and I've actually done that before. I've made like little tractors in game. But I think that uh, it's probably not worth it, you know? Have you guys been checking out Cogmind? If you haven't, go check that out. I think most of the people who watch me doing Cataclysm um play cogmind but i could be wrong about that so uh I, I was just kind of curious about what the overlap was between the two communities good farm all the plots and then um i'm curious if i go to this yeah i still haven't even completed the first two i won't do all of it i just wanted to basically um get some essentials up and up and going so that they're growing if I'm looking at my plots, uh, tomatoes, what else do we have here? Uh, so we've got our zucchini, we got tomatoes. Uh, soybean would be definitely good to have some of that. Yeah, definitely gonna do that. And then we'll just plot those. And then what was the other stuff? It would ni it'd be nice to get some potatoes. Potatoes are a really good food source, right? I mean, it's not just like the potato famine. <laughs> it actually is like a good food source. I wish there was a way to till things. Like if I, I'm just curious if I go to, if I just go to this and I say I want like, um, hold on. I want to do like, yeah, it's not, I'm not really seeing any other options that would that would help us out. So we'll just we'll just kind of keep on going how we're going and just make a couple different plots. Um barley I definitely want cuz I love making some bread. Oh man, it's going to be so cool. I mean, if you've if you've watched my uh other series, then you know just how much I like to make some bread. God, we've got so many companions. This is awesome. Like, we have way more companions than I had um, 
in my other game. I did see, though, that they've removed the control laptop, which I'm pretty upset about because it's like, okay, how do we get cyborgs then? Like, from the lab? Because I, I really like that they have that feature. I hope that they're they're considering that with the design aspect. I'm sure they are, but it is also one of those things that could have been um, some oversight, you know? Um, let's see, what else did we want to plant here? What is it that I'm standing on? Is that Datura? That I think is for plant mutagen, so I actually don't really... Oh, cucumber, whoops, that was the wrong thing. Go ahead and plant the Datura, and... <laughs> I think you know what this is, but maybe you don't. The plant that was up here. Wait, what? Really? I'm trying to plant stuff. <laughs> This bird. Uh, I'm going to have to shoot at it without having an aimed attack on it, really. Wait. I just shot that bird. I guess I clipped it in the wing. <laughs> How is that even possible? <laughs> We've got like a military gun. Like a really nice one. <laughs> we just clipped that bird. That is hilarious. Oh, now people are coming out to check up on the sound that I made. That's funny. Um, go ahead. Farm. Wait, really? Uh, am I... Why is this not working? Yeah, that should be something that I'm doing. Is it because that was there or something? Yeah. I think it was. But why is this not getting planted? I don't understand. Um, let's see, what else were we trying to do? I think that that is kind of good for now. Um, I will come back and do the rest. But I think I'll do that off camera. Like, you guys don't need to be with me for planting of every single last thing, but I did want to kind of show you how I was trying to automate some of it. Um, maybe I'll put these things... I'll put these things in the base. Because, um, yeah, I think that that's probably a good call. Not to have the seeds just laying out outside somewhere. You know, Nosh, right now... Probably is pretty happy with his collection of animal friends, but, um, you know, I think he would want them working a little bit harder, you know, but they don't have any food. So we gotta, we gotta feed these guys. Um, if I look at the notes, we had said we we're gonna get water for the car and go hunting. Yeah, let's go, let's go hunting. Um... I'm just going to leave the companions here, I think, while I'm out hunting, and hopefully they don't all starve to death. I think that uh, Louise and Tasia has been just, like, feeding themselves while we've been out and about, though. So I think that that's what's going on there. Um, I know I can't get mutant meat, but I think if we find just about any creature, to be honest, um, that has meat, and then we... We eat it. I think that that would probably be a good call. So where's that turkey? There was a turkey around here somewhere that I was just looking at. There you are. Come here, turkey. I don't think that we'll get a lot of fat, but we should get a good amount of meat from turkeys, right? Let's get right up close to the turkeys, and then I'll shoot a couple. Okay, we're stopped. And that, let's get uh, the gun out. Turkey died. Turkey died. Wait, really? Wow, that turkey uh, took a couple bullets there. I'm impressed. Okay, let's, uh, let's stop running. And it's mangled, which is a shame because that does mean I think we'll get less from butchering it. But uh, sorry about the heartbeat. Um, 
if I try and butcher this, it's gonna say, oh no, I can actually do it without carrying anything. Cool. Just catch your breath, it's fine. Um, yeah, that's a good amount of meat right there. I'm pretty happy with that. Let's get that in the fridge as much as we can. Because I think... Yes, we can, we can actually take it all. Nice. I think I'm going to leave the feathers, though. And it is a shame that we're going to kind of run out of breath here, but I think it's worth it. I think that we need the need the food. I also am kind of bummed out that we didn't go for something that has more fat in it. Because the fat um, is like a lot of calories. Also, can I turn off these headlights? I just remembered from a second ago that I saw that and then did nothing. <laughs> okay, um, full butchery. Yep, same deal. And then... Oh wow, that, that bird got demolished more from the shots that we fired. And then I think there was a third one around here somewhere, right? That we killed... Yeah, right in front of us. And that should be good. Again, apologies for the heartbeat. I'm just gonna... Mute that for a second. It's it's still loud for me, but I figured you guys don't need to listen to that while we're doing this. I know that some people told me to turn down the sound for the the heartbeat, and I think I did, but I'm not. It's really hard to get an idea for it actually what it sounds like, and it is a good indicator for me. So I'm not wanting to get rid of it entirely, you know. Yes, awesome. Even the raw liver. Nice. Um, sure, take 50. And then I'll just drive that back to our base and we'll we'll take care of things there in terms of food production. Uh, actually, we're at, at the base, basically. Just need to go like up this road. And we're there. <laughs> it's like that South Park and it's gone. <laughs> I actually didn't watch a lot of South Park, but one of my friends was really into it growing up, and I always found it really gross and weird. Um, but I'm glad that my friend exposed it to me, because it actually is super good. I actually nowadays um, appreciate it. If I try and dehydrate some meat... I'm curious... Um, if I try and do that, that's 21 minutes, 19 minutes. We'll go with the 19 minute then. That's weird, it doesn't seem... Oh, we don't have the charge to do that number. Um, let's do the one that we have the charges for and then we'll replace the battery. Oh, I don't know why I'm dehydrating. I should be just making fresh meat, like fresh cooked meat. It's so much faster. Um, yeah, cooked meat, yep. Yeah. Oh, it's not so much faster. It is considerably faster, but it's not like, whoa, way fast. Um, this will take two hours. Okay, we'll do that, and then we'll put that meat on the table. That should be a good amount of calories, though, right? That's a lot of cooked meat, at the very least. Um, sure, we'll take that. Yep. And let's see how many calories we get from that. I know that uh, someone was saying they wanted me to remove the needs of NPCs, and I probably will do that, but I want to give myself the illusion that we have the needs taken care of, so I'm just kind of curious as to what that would what that would entail. And, you know, like, when has Nosh actually gone out and hunted? This has created a cool kind of opportunity for us to have some interesting um, drive kind of for us. Okay, so that... We have two days worth of rations. That's not a lot. I mean, that's a good amount, but it's not a lot. I think they must have drank all the milk that I got last episode, because I... I don't know. I thought we had more. Cooked meat and cooked scraps of meat. The enjoyability isn't actually as bad as I thought it would be for that. Okay, yeah, keep on doing it. Is that taking us longer? I know that we're like... uh really tired right now but i'm kind of also waiting for night for that exact reason because it's kind of nice to line up 
your your sleep schedule in in game with the actual day night cycle at least that's my preference i know like Vormathrax and others really like to do um like night raiding and everything and i know that our character is even built for that but just i don't know feels kind of weird um can i put the cooked meat back in there and try and do more meat how much more do we have okay only eight pieces that's that's good i was kind of getting a little tired of that but it took us like half the episode to take care of the farm and getting us a little bit a couple days worth of food and if we have to just go kill a couple turkeys every, uh, how many days? Um, I would like to be able to take the eight meat with us, but it's being kind of weird. Hello everyone, I can't see you, but don't mind me. I'm just gonna put that there. Must have walked by a cow because I saw it, but I didn't actually see it, you know what I mean? Uh, oh, actually we were carrying the eight meat there anyways. Can I take my meat and do the scrap meat? I think they'll eat that as well, right? Seven minutes. Okay. Why not, right? Uh, can I repeat that? Yes, I can. And repeat it. No, just keep on repeating it. Okay, and then I think there was one group that yeah we didn't finish because we were scratching our arm okay cool scraps of meat come with me uh can i do i have a flashlight i do okay it was getting a little bit annoying okay cool so we have all that meat and this meat yeah i think if we just got a ton of lard then they would be fine Okay, how many days of cow, uh, food do we have now? Five days, that's great. Okay, so if I have that much food, can I get them to do any work? I could send someone out to uh, try and recruit for more followers, but I don't think we should get more people if we can't really support them. Hunt large animals, though. Uh, marksmanship. Huh. I don't know if... Yeah, it could use more food food than what we're going to get from it. So I'm not sure if we want to do that. Um, Let's see. Yeah, I don't really want them cooking food. Oh, I could have assigned someone to cook meat. <laughs> Whoops. But it uses up charge, so... I mean, that means that we need someone to make charcoal. Can they mass produce charcoal, or do I need to give them... That. I would actually know we could just battery power it right yeah a lot of those things uh like the uh I think like the stove or chemistry set yeah we could get like a chemistry set and just change out the batteries or something and they would actually be able to do that then hmm that is interesting uh there's no real upgrades that I want to do here um, what about if we look to the, um, the north? How do we do this? I want to go over there. Uh, go to the next tab is tab. It doesn't look like I'm able to tab over. Um, okay, so I guess we need to have some wooden racks or something. I don't know. Yeah. We're gonna need to, it looks like it says, work on this, um, this base itself. 14 planks, wooden panel, door hinge. That seems very, very easy. So, yeah, it's saying that we need to build, okay, is this build some pantry storage? I think that'll make things last longer. Um, yeah. And then this is like for bedroom walls. I'm just kind of confused about the um, scale of this. It's like standard versus wood panel walls. That doesn't seem right. Why is it so much more versus so much less? Right? 
It's crazy. Okay, let's uh, let's work on getting some panels, uh, planks, and door hinges, because I think we have that all in this place south of us. So if I just go over here, um, there's definitely panels. There's not going to be door handles though. Um, if I look at this, I'm just curious if I butcher one of these. Uh, yes, yeah, splintered wood. Okay. So definitely want one wooden panel. And then I think we're going to need to go somewhere else then. Oh, I forgot about our smoker that's down there. <laughs> oh man, it would also be great if we could like burn the cow pies as fuel because I know that people do that in like India. Um, let's put this here. Now I need to go... Well, I probably need to sleep because our character is super tired, but maybe we need to drive over to, like, not the farm, because the farm is going to be, like, I don't know. Like, we need to get these. I think we could go to the power plant and get the stuff from there. Yeah, that sounds reasonable to me. Let's, let's just drive a little bit away from here. Uh, hold on. Sorry. <laughs> the doors and the windows that all, that always messes me up man let's just drive up and over we'll get our headlights on as well and our flashlight off you want to make sure you can actually see in front of you imagine trying to drive with just a headlight you know i saw a post uh on reddit the other day about this person who was super happy they'd gotten a car and it was just like this old beater car you know it was just like totally beat up and just like hardly working and they are like saying they could hardly see out of the windshields um and i you know i just thought maybe maybe they should try that <laughs> well i these these messages that pop up i have kind of given up on trying to resolve them um do we have our toolbox with us? Please tell me I have my toolbox. Do I have... I think we may have left our toolbox. It's a multi-tool. Will that let me disassemble things? I bet it doesn't, but I'm going to try. Can I then do... Deconstruct. No, I need something with hammering. Okay, I can do that. I know mean, rock has hammering in it, you know? Um, what's the quality hammering? Yep. Um, sure, I'll take the makeshift crowbar. Seeing it with two of them. Figures that we, uh, we could use one, right? Uh, deconstruct... what? Okay, needs hammering of two. That makes sense, actually. Can I make a hammer at all? Or should I just go back to the base? Um, I was also thinking about making that for our super strong dude. That's gonna take two hours. That takes six minutes. Does that have hammering too? It does. Hey, and so does this. Um, okay, well, let's just get a plank then. Um, can I punch this? I can. <laughs> I just punched a, a sign. That would hurt, man. That would, like, seriously hurt. I would expect some damage on the torso there. Um, and then let's see, hammer. Engineer's hammer, man. No way. Uh, makeshift hammer, sure. And then we'll get that. Thank you. It's quicker than driving back, at least in real world time. Deconstruct furniture. If I can get a two door hinges, nice. And some planks, then I'm happy. Um, we also are carrying a ton of stuff that we don't need to be doing. And I should probably also unload our car. And I'm just realizing now that I've had the sound off for like how many minutes now? Oh God. That was a while ago. I don't even want to think about how long the, the in-game sound's been off. Sorry. 
imagine that our character was deaf. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's unload some of this stuff. We got we got a lot of stuff. Like a lot, a lot of stuff. We definitely want to keep the plans. That's actually junk. I probably should just dump that. Um, sure. Okay, that's full. Um, we'll keep that on us. Um, we'll keep those on us. Tablet can go away. I I thought the tablet we were gonna be able to like type in it, but we weren't able to. It's just basically like photos. So yeah. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff that we were carrying on us that we didn't really need. Uh, and then, I think that that should be enough to get the planks. Can I actually dump the plank that I'm carrying right now? Yes, I can. Cool. And then we'll go and get more, more planks and whatnot. Uh, hold on, what happened there? There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Those planks, yep. And I'm hearing plank. Are these things dead? They are dead. I I must have came through here, huh? Yeah, we're gonna have to get a lot of planks to make this all all hunky dory. Um I think it was like 20-ish of them or something. That's five. It's, uh, it's better than nothing. Uh, and now we're just dropping the planks on the ground. Great. The table's kind of full. The other two slots are, are totally spacious though. Okay, cool. Well, well, we'll get the planks in then like that. And hopefully I don't have to make multiple trips because it looks like we might actually... Ah, uh, that's so annoying. If we have to, like, maybe I can get, like, a backpack or something. Do I have, like, a big old backpack? I do not see any big old backpacks. Um, let's see. Anything up here? Oh, there's a molly pack. I'll take that, sure. Anything that will let me carry these things, I think, is good. The other things are not really storage containers, so not worth it. You know, we could actually disassemble, like, this stuff now. Um, and I might even be able to just push some of this stuff up. There we go. Okay. And then we'll disassemble that. It's kind of funny the purse came across, too. Yeah, see, it was a good idea to do that with the planks, because now we have to travel less distance, right? Um, yeah, I think that we're going to need to come back here, though, by the looks of it. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that we've got as many planks as we can carry, at least for now. And then we'll unload them at the base and see what we can do about this bedroom. I think that we'll be able to get, like, a actual farm like the npc base farm farms like that they intended for people to do if they want to farm um like to the north or like maybe i'll get like a i really want a kitchen or a blacksmith that's really what i want i think i want to build a blacksmith in station because that's gonna be the most useful is using people to craft stuff for me so that i don't have to do it myself but it's gonna take so much time to get that off off the ground um, so let's see. Got our planks. And we'll get all of those down there. Any other planks now? <laughs> That's a funny way of spelling plank, huh? Okay, so that's six. Oh. Did I just hit a button? Yeah, I think that we're okay. Any other planks? No, just the six that we had stored there. Okay, so we got 12. Um, I think we needed 14. 
I didn't write it down. Nosh could have could have written it down on his little scratch paper if he'd uh, been thinking ahead. A uh, paint chipper is what we need. Huh. I bet we can make one of those. Right? I mean, I can guarantee you we don't have one because why would I have a paint chipper? But I'm, I should check. Yeah. I knew that. Um, paint chipper, 10 minutes. That takes almost no time. Really? And it's broom, heavy stick. Okay, well, we'll just go get one of those from down here. Um, seeing how we are, like, we're so close. I might as well get the project started, you know, that we're working on. Just so I can at least say that I got one base project started. Watch, we don't have enough food or something. And feel it. Um, I'm just going to let it go for just a little long because I do want to do this. Paint. Chipper, yep. Very strange. So we're removing the paint from around here. Um, I'm just curious about what is going to happen when we do this. Um, paint chipper. I thought I made one. I have one. Oh, it needs to be in the base, right? Isn't that how it works? It's not my inventory, because it's not me doing something. It's my NPCs. Yes, here we go. Yeah, I feel like they're just taking the stuff off the walls, but that's fine. Tasia is extremely overqualified. <laughs> cool. Um, while Tasia is doing that, um, that's going to take two hours. I should probably just sleep, but yeah. I don't know. I'll think about what we're going to do next. Um, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.